Welcome to the Dad Got Parks Disney Character Warehouse update for the international location. Right off the bat, we have a super awesome droid hand photo frame. These are from the Droid Depot in Galaxy's Edge, and I was shocked to see it there. A little bit more Galaxy's Edge merch here. We have a Jedi figurine, $9.99 instead of $20. Not bad. And this Ariel's Grotto playset. Cool little kids playset for 35 bucks. Why was the mermaid's baby octopus missing? It was squidnapped. Waka waka. Oh my god, squidnapped. That's terrible. The playset's fine. The squidnapped's horrible. This is awesome. Lots of cool Galaxy's Edge merch. 95 bucks. I do not know what the retail was. And then you've got the nine inch Lux edition Mickey and Minis. These are like 150 bucks. And Orange Bird, for you Orange Bird fans out there like my sister, they had an Orange Bird tote that I have not seen anywhere before. And I don't know if it's a good price or not, though. I don't know what the retail was. I know I showed these before, but I love this bag. I love this pattern. 35 bucks is not a bad price. It was worth getting a repeat. And Dress Shop Dresses at legit pricing. 40 bucks. That's way better than like the 55 or 85 or I've seen them try to sell them for 90 before. So this was pretty cool. And it's actually a pretty dress. Look, it's Admiral Akbar doing like his little dance that he does. It's like trap dancing. Oh, that's bad. That's terrible. I leave the jokes to the bear. Little droid for $9.99. Lots of cool Star Wars merch here at the international location. And then they had the EG-01. I don't, I think he was in Jabba's palace maybe. God, that's tough. Can't remember. I do know the gonk power droids. I know those and that EG other one looks very much like it. That's what I thought it was, but ooh. This is a cool like camo shirt. I like these. $12.99 is a great price. And they had a good assortment on it. Baby Yoda in camo, super cute. Love it. 99 cents for a patch. It is the uh, Rainbow Pride patch, but still, it is 99 cents instead of 10 bucks. That's a huge discount. And then they had a lot more uh, Black Spire type merch, 25 instead of 36.99. I like that design, and it's pretty nice lightweight material. Seemed like a good shirt. These are your rank badges if you are cosplaying as a first order person. Yeah, first orderer. And here's other resistance badges these are what they wear if you want to be on the good side so bad side for the first ones good side for these you get to choose more shirts this one says rebels or resist sort of it's for the rebels but it says resist i can read i swear i can um 15 bucks and this is a black spire day shirt which i think is what they were trying to rebrand star wars day as in galaxy's edge um, $22.99, eh, I'd rather that $12.99 price. I love these Lando dolls. They're awesome. He's got the cape. Lando's got the best capes in the business, folks. And this one is awesome, $4.99. These are super not comfortable, but they're five bucks. They light up. And I love the retail price of $32.86, the most odd retail price in Disney. A nice, cool little good vibes hat. I know somebody who's uh, big into the good vibes, a good friend of mine. You might know him, Drew in the moment. Go check him out. And then this one, I could not figure out if this was youth or adult sizing. It's very big for youth and small for adults. I don't know. And this one, these Jedi What ropes. did Obi-Wan say to Luke at dinner? Use the forks, Luke. Waka waka. Oh man, use the forks. These Jedi robes are like the ones you'd wear to go and cosplay or to go on to the Star Cruiser. Super cool, 60 bucks. Dad really kind of wanted to buy them. I love this mean mickey face i don't know pretty cool like a uh, windbreaker style thing very lightweight i don't know if it is uh rainproof or not and these are some super stretchy spandex pants um the hulk would love these because spandex is your best friend for him and uh, these are like a bunch of her universe 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 denim type stuff and it's got the mickey 28 this was 25.99 and then there are an overall dress, which is kind of like overalls, but a dress. That's pretty obviously to state that, Dad. Uh, okay. We're going to move on to 
the jean jacket, which is very New Jersey. There are very few things that are quintessential New Jersey, but I think a jean jacket is one of them. This is a cool one with the Mickey Mouse faded on the back. 28 jeans. These are um, kind of like those stretchy kind of jeans. They're jeans, but they're not jeans, if that makes sense. And then these are your true overalls with like the pant legs and everything. I remember having overalls as a kid. I loved them. They were just so comfy. I wonder if overalls are back in. Can somebody let me know if overalls are in? This is like a cool denim -y shirt. And I just love that. That design's awesome in the back. Super like classic Mickey. Perfect. And then one of the best things about the vinyl location is you get to dig through the racks and try to find like special treasures and gems. Like this one was pretty cool. The, the people mover. The power to move you, $9.99. Not bad. Now, I couldn't find anything in that rack that was $0.99. Cents. Not a single thing. $14.99 for a little uh, test track action. Pretty cool. I like that with the pink and the blue. That's why I thought it was a women's shirt, but I could be wrong. And then this one. I found a Tommy Bahama t-shirt in the rack. I think it's a women's sizing. Might be a men's, but I don't know. It's women's to me. And then these were awesome i like these they're like comic book looking super cool i like the graphic style of them 15 instead of 50 on both the pants and the shirt which i thought was a great deal but this was an even better deal 12.99 instead of 50 bucks 12.99 that's a, a super huge discount i thought it was wonderful but the pants cost more the pants are more than the top that doesn't make any sense to me. It just seems like the, it should be the other way around. And coming up is a Muppets shirt. I love the Muppets. How do the Muppets make money? A Fonzie scheme. Waka waka. Oh my gosh, you worked yourself into the joke. That's either great or terrible. I'm not sure. And look, it's a tribute to all nations, but mostly America. I love this shirt, man. It's a patriotic looking shirt, 26 bucks, super awesome. Wish they had it in my size, I would totally wear it. And Stitch for $14.99 instead of 45 bucks for some fluffy pants. Ugh, you can't trust that Stitch. You also can't trust Shop Disney sometimes because we paid for more th for this on Shop Disney than it was here. It kind of made the wife a little angry. But sometimes they have better prices on Shop Disney. You never know. I had never seen this pin, 10 bucks instead of 30. I thought it was a cool pin. And I thought it was a cool price, so that's why I showed it to you. Now it's time for everybody's favorite game show. What did Dad buy? I'm back again. I don't know if you've come from the last video, which was the Vineland video, or if this is your first video and you have to go to the Vineland video after this one, but Dad went to two outlets in one day today and they were great. Awesome prices, very busy, uh, lines are back. So make your plans accordingly. Also, the outlets are now open at 11 o'clock on weekends instead of 10 o'clock. Just keep that in mind. This is the international location. And I popped over there after going to Vineland just to see if there was any new stuff. And there was a couple new things. And, and, and kind of one thing in particular. I only bought two things. One of them was a little glow in the dark Elliot the Dragon wishable. He was $7.99 instead of like $15 or $15.99, I think. So I thought he was cute to go with the large Elliot Dragon that I got over at Vineland. The other one, yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna show you. I, I bought the droid hand from the Droid Depot. Um, <laughs> this is like C-3PO's hand. And they were $85. I've been eyeing this thing in Galaxy's Edge forever, but it was just too much money. It was it was too much. It was it was, too, it was $29.99. And now I have C3PO's hand. And I think it even works where like I don't have to use the photo frame if I want. I can just put it up as hand. Uh, I'm not gonna unbox this and go over it here. I'm gonna do a separate unboxing video for this. So stay subscribed and make sure you have all those notifications and everything on if you wanna see this thing in greater detail. Now, I had to make a deal with the wife 
that I would get rid of something on the shelf. I would sell it to be able to buy this one. So I'm gonna have to make a hard decision and figure out what's gonna go from the shelf to be able to, to put the C-3PO hand on there, but I think it's gonna be worth it. I hope you guys are enjoying my videos. They'll be coming a lot more frequently now that the kiddo is going back to school and I'll have more of my days available to go to the parks and go to the outlets and all kinds of fun stuff. So if you're enjoying my content, please make sure you're subscribed. I am giving away a advent calendar, a Halloween advent calendar at 7,000 subscribers and I have the memberships and all that kind of stuff. So that information is all in the description below. Super excited the outlets are kind of back. Great pricing, awesome finds, cool, neat merchandise. I'm very pumped. All right, dad has so much to do that he doesn't know what to say, but I do know dad doesn't do outros. So that's it, bye. Thanks for watching. Consider maybe watching one of my vlogs. We went to Typhoon Lagoon twice recently, been in Magic Kingdom, been to Disney Springs. Maybe check something of them out. Something of them? Yeah, we're gonna go with that as being English. I'm just giving up now and saying bye.